With a Casio FX82 AU+, or Casio FX100 AU+, scientific notation can be used to work with large or small numbers. The use of the calculator's memory to store these numbers can be useful. To enter the radius of the observable universe, use the times 10 to the power of x key to enter it in scientific notation. To store this value as A in the calculator's memory, press SHIFT and then the RECALL key, then choose the negative key as it corresponds to the red letter A. Now calculate the volume of the observable universe as a sphere, calling up the radius that was stored in the memory as A by pressing ALPHA then the negative key as required. As we can see, this large value is presented in scientific notation form. To convert this volume to cubic millimetres, this answer needs to be multiplied by 10 to the power of 9, being the number of cubic millimetres in a cubic metre. Helpfully, this answer is temporarily stored in the calculator as ANTS, the last answer. This last answer can be called up by pressing the ANSWER key. It can also be called up and operated upon by pressing any operation key, like division, subtraction, etc. To multiply the volume answer by 10 to the power of 9, press the multiply key, which shows the answer has been recalled, then multiply by 1 times 10 to the power of 9, using the times 10 to the power of x key as required. So, the universe's volume, measured in cubic millimetres, is pretty big, but a Google, being 10 to the power of 100, is more than 10 billion times bigger. This value can be added to memory in another way. The memory plus key adds the current answer to whatever is stored in the memory M. To clear the value of memory M, or any other memory for that matter, press 0 and then store it as that value using shift and recall.